Hello, in this video, I am going to explain more details about Taxi App and the purpose of this video is to let you understand how Taxi App like Uber work. Firstly, Taxi App enables you to submit a trip request. It automatically finds your location and logs GPS data. It then matches you with the closest Uber driver available. When a driver accepts your trip, you'll see their name, license plate, photo, rating, and a temporary substitute telephone number. Sample of Taxi App includes Uber, Lyft, Get, Grab, Curb, Juno, Halo, Ola Cabs and more. Now let's talk about the advanced Taxi App features to be different than Uber. When it's clear that we need some advanced features to be different and really unique, let's go in detail on what we need. To start with Uber-like or an on-demand Taxi App model, you'll need a driver, user, and admin app. The admin or dispatcher panel stays behind the scene but the drivers and users remain at the front. They communicate with your users. Hence, it is required that you bring on the most delightful and useful experience for them with the help of an experienced taxi booking app builder. And to create a taxi app, it starts with 1. Give your user the option to schedule rides. Do you remember how Curb did it? No matter how fast or promise to send a taxi, there is no guarantee that the user will find a car just when they need it. The on-demand ride gets too overwhelming, especially at prime office hours. This is also a reason why you should think of a feature like scheduling a ride or ride later. What you need is a taxi booking app development team that takes care of developing this feature. If you have an advanced booking feature, you must also think of adding options to edit their trip details and cancel the trip. You must think of the driving inconvenience here. Set up a time limit or cancellation charges if required. As an add-on to create a taxi app like Curb, you can think of sending a notification to the user 30 minutes before the trip starts. 2. Let your user share ETA and trip status for safety and convenience. We all run behind time at some point in time. And safety becomes a major concern for both men and women. What majors are you taking for your users who are traveling late at night? Well, I would suggest having the feature to share ETA and current location status right on a button tap. This put our well wishes and family at ease as they know our whereabouts. This feature can be integrated with the help of a single button message function right from the app. You need to have it discussed with your app development team to understand how they're gonna integrate the API for this. Make sure the message goes instantly to the concerned family member as saved by the rider. For a backup plan, you can also integrate preferred social networks and email to share the ride status. Ask for this feature for your taxi booking app builder in New York. 3. Go beyond the limited extra stops when you create a taxi app. How many stops does Uber allow? Well, just three. So, can you imagine what convenience you're offering your users if you increase it further? This is the exact pain point of your user, which you can solve with extra stop feature while en route. There are times when people travel with groups and might need to stop at several places to grab their necessities. With such a convenient multi-stop feature, users can enjoy their ride seamlessly. You can build a taxi booking app which is better than Uber in this case. Keep it the stop limited to 3 minutes and you are good to go. 4. What about driver rider chit chats on in-app messaging? Ain't it at times difficult to call your driver and make him understand where exactly you are? Uber has recently recognized the pain and started the driver and user in-app chat option. It was really inconvenient to switch between apps to communicate. This can be easily solved with in-app messaging. Real-time chats will help the driver and rider further to be at a common touchpoint. And for the convenience of drivers, they can send a thumbs up to reply, without getting distracted. 5. The hero feature bidding between riders and drivers. Well, you should know that a majority of the taxi app users are frustrated due to the high far charges. And at times, drivers feel that they are underpaid. Is there even a solution to this drama? It seems yes, there is. Introducing the bidding feature between driver and users. We did for one of our clients, Bid Ride. Here is a snapshot. How does this work? 
Whenever a rider creates a ride request with a particular destination, we show them an estimated fare based on a rate chart. The fare can be modified from your admin panel. On confirmation, the rider creates a bidding request with a bid equal to the initial fare estimate. The bid goes to all the nearby drivers. Now, it comes to the driver. He has got two options. 1. Accept bid, driver can accept the bid. In case the driver accepts the bid, the acceptance request goes to the rider which in turn has to be acknowledged by him. After which the rider can make a payment for the same and the trip is confirmed. 2. Make a counter bid, driver can make a counter bid in case he doesn't approve the initial bid. After making a counter bid, the same goes for the rider. The rider has got two options for the same, either counter bid, that will again go to driver or accept the bid made by the driver, make a payment and book the driver for a ride. The full bidding process to build a taxi booking app is real-time and done with the help of MQTT, message queuing telemetry transport. 6. The benefits and convenience of subscription-based system feature. Another interesting and unique feature can be a subscription-based system. Never heard of it? Let me explain. In the subscription-based system, a rider is asked to buy a distance in kilometers against some specific money. These kilometers are purchased against different plans. You can adjust the plan right from your admin panel. It is in your control to ascertain KM's validity for a month or two. After its expiration, the rider subscription is auto-renewed with new KM's credited to the account. To set the payment, a number of payment gateway integrations are available including Stripe, Braintree and CC Avenue. But what if the rider uses up the KMs? Well, let them buy a brand new subscription for the month. It's that simple. As the ride fare is deducted by the KMs traveled by a rider, they can renew it anytime. Think it is difficult for you? Let our experienced taxi app development team handle that. 7. The Side Hero feature split fare share trip payment with others. There's nothing better than splitting the fare when you are traveling in a group, right? It seems to be the same for your users as well. They are always looking for a taxi app that can help them save more. But wait. Split fare comes to the rescue. It makes riding affordable for everyone. When your user orders a ride with his group, they no more need to pay for the fare alone. And no more awkwardness to ask their friend to split the fare. The app will automatically split the fare and share the details with everyone traveling. This nifty small feature can be a lifesaver for your user. No more calculations and your app are going to get more attention. 8. Fuss free driver compliments and tips. Rating the drivers might not always be the best way to explain the riding experience and service riders receive from them. And that's the reason, you might think about providing the riders a number of options to thank the drivers. In the previous years, Uber had introduced quite a few features for the riders to thank their drivers. Complimenting them with great conversation, excellent service, cool car, etc. Are some of those. Though there are other perks that you can add. Tipping the drivers with monetary bonus might be considered as a prime feature as well. Providing the drivers with extra money other than the price charged would help to boost up their enthusiasm. And what if the tipping gets cashless? Cashless tipping can help to eliminate the discomfort the riders face while calculating and providing the riders with cash for real. Not only that but getting tipped cashlessly would also help the riders handle their funds easily. 9. Can surge pricing attract more customers? You judge. Now this optional. Surge pricing is a great deal when it comes to leading taxi app giants like Uber and Lyft. Get and Curb, on the other hand, are against surge pricing. Let me tell in brief how surge pricing works and why, why not it is beneficial for your taxi app startup. Demand for rides increases mostly in the rush hours. So many people are requesting rides and there are not enough cars to meet the demand. Other situations can be bad weather, festivities, etc. may cause a large number of requests from everywhere. In these cases, a majority of taxi apps shoot up the fare charge depending on the rider's location. Now, this can be quite frustrating for riders as they have to pay up to 2.5x to 3x the normal fare. 
but it ensures the highest in-demand rider gets the ride. Rides have the choice to pay more or wait. This might harm your user base. So think before you implement it. What's your take on these advanced features? There is no limit to the imagination when it comes to setting the features of a taxi app. I have tried to help you with the most upcoming and trendy features which can differentiate you from others. If you are up to take risks, the entire market is yours. Want to discuss your taxi app idea with an expert? The top taxi booking app builder is there for you. Tell us how and where you want to launch your taxi app and we'll make the difference. 10. Maps and Location The technology of GPS tracking is used to identify the current location, find cars and track the way. Besides, the perfect journey tracking gives the actual estimation. 11. In-app payments Having an app without a payment gateway solution fully compliant and working fine is the same thing as having a Tesla car without a battery. Inbuilt payments allow a user to pay for the ride right from the app. The current technology also enables transferring money between drivers on mobile. If you want to process credit card payments directly from your clients, you need to use a payment service such as Stripe, Braintree, PayU or HyperPay that partially does the job for you. The integration of such payment options involves technical complexity that consumes numerous hours and resources which can lead to an increase in app cost. 12. Built-in module to collect fees from drivers. Paying the driver in cashless installments using the driver's credit cards is a must. The system should allow you to make your own rules, set up how, when, and how much fees you want to get from your drivers. Create multiple subscription plans, select a billing cycle and forget about manual paperwork. The system handles payments automatically. The driver has access to the current balance, subscription details, top-up features and a list of transactions. 13. Smart Analytics System Doing your business with no analytical data is like driving a car with your eyes closed. Get numbers, analyze them every month or day, and improve your business accordingly. Having the information about every bit of your business in well-presented reports will help you see where your business needs some improvements and where it is doing good. Track the number of orders, booking sources, assigned versus missed orders, yes, you need to track that. Make decisions only based on real numbers. The integration of those invisible features can take a 10 to 20% additional budget. 14. Profiles. The basic requirement of authorization has various reasons. First, for online payment, it is necessary. Also, details like driver name contact number, profile pic, license details can be added. It makes the choice to ratings and reviews more personalized. After all, a driver and a customer also can share and see their contact details to have smooth communication between them. 15. Communication. When you build the first app, push notifications and in-app messages are a must to inform passengers and drivers about news and campaigns that you may have for them. 16. Dispatch and Tracking Panel Web-based panel with Google Maps to take phone bookings, manage taxi, drivers and assign trips. It also allows company owners to track drivers with their status, track orders created from passenger apps and web desk. API, required to communicate between apps and pass messages to and from the call center. 17. Maintenance. Never go for a team, which cannot offer maintenance of your app, even if you do not plan new features, new iOS versions, and new iPhones are released, so you need to constantly improve your app.